now that we have elixir installed it's time to start learning more about elixir but first before learning we need to start unlearning because a lot of concepts from the object oriented world does not exist in the functional world so that brings me to the very first statement if i say a is equal to 1 and if i ask you what do you think of it most probably you'll say that a is a variable and the value of 1 is being assigned to the variable of a well you are right but that's not what is happening inside the functional world if i take you back to your high school days and just imagine that you are taking your very basic algebra classes in that class what we learned was a is equal to 1 that means a is your left hand side and 1 is your right hand side so what maths is trying to say is your left hand side is equal to your right hand side your basic algebra does not say that 1 is being assigned to a that concept does not exist now if we say that if the left hand side is equal to the right hand side that means the right hand side should also be equal to the left hand side so if i say that a is equal to 1 that means even this statement should hold true and that is what happens in the world of elixir as well we will also have a demo of this shortly right now just keep in mind that equal to is not the assignment operator this is the match operator and what this operator does is that it simply matches your right hand side to your left hand side and you are going to see this pattern a lot inside elixir this is also called as pattern matching and this is a very powerful thing inside elixir every time you see a statement like this always remember that we are simply trying to match the right hand side with the left hand side now for the demo let us open up our terminal elixir actually ships with an interactive shell or an repel so let us see how we can open it up and start using elixir we can enter inside the interactive shell by typing i e x you can clear the terminal by typing clear so here we can say that my a is equal to 1 now if we say that is my 1 is equal to my a and we get the output as true you can also type as 1 is equal to a and this simply gives back the value because 1 and a both hold the same value of 1 let me clear this up let us try with one more experiment suppose i say that my name is octalium so in this case if i say that is octalium equal to my name then we should get the answer of true and yes that's what it is so just keep in mind that this is equal to is not assignment we are simply trying to pattern match the right hand side to the left hand side 